baseball, hot dogs, and CBP? Not such a unique combination. U.S. Customs and Border Protection Honor Guard teams have been opening for great American sporting events around the country. Opening for a New York Yankees baseball game soon after the anniversary of 9-11 is even greater. The house that Ruth built, Yankee Stadium in the South Bronx of New York, a shrine to some. A fall afternoon brings out fans to see America's most storied franchise prepare for another postseason appearance. As they filed in to catch the pregame ceremonies, members of the CBP Honor Guard also prepared to take the field to proudly display the colors that unite our nation, an agency, and a city. To be able to walk out here and to look at the stands and see the people in the stands, it's quite a feeling. When I think the New York Yankees is a worldwide organization, they're very renowned, very prestigious for them to be able to reach out to us, sort of elevates us to that same level. We are an international agency, and to be able to come out here and work with this organization and show New York who we are, I think it says wonders about us. Well, New York is a, it's a great sports uh, city. The New York Yankees have a great tradition of being champions. We're from New York. It's a great opportunity. It's a privilege for us to be able to come out here and to be able to present the national colors in front of our hometown crowd. 9-11 was a tragic event for us. We had six World Trade Center. That was the home for customers for many years downtown New York. That building was completely devastated as the events of 9-11 unfolded. We've been able to overcome that over the years. With the 11th anniversary of 9-11 still fresh in the hearts and minds of New Yorkers, the boys of Summer and CBP were able to rekindle the spirit that united a nation and created U.S. Customs and Border Protection. From Yankee Stadium in the South Bronx, I'm Michael Pope for CBP Frontline News.